Welcome to the press room of the FIDE World Chess Grand Prix in Sharjah. Here with us are uh, Jon Ludwig Hammer and uh, Francisco Vallejo Pons. The game ended in a draw. It was not a very long game, but quite interesting from the theoretical point of view. Um, uh, yeah, uh, apparently the theory was more advanced uh, than, uh, than I knew. Uh, so I was sitting there trying to figure out stuff and Paco was still in his analysis. Um, I actually have a, a, a story about this opening uh, because before the 2015 Norwich Chess qualifier, uh, I played a couple of blitz games with Magnus mm -hmm. and, and I was planning to, to play this opening with the black pieces uh, and, and I was playing it against Magnus and, and he played this rook c1 and then kind of just basically he didn't do anything aggressive, he just stood there and, and played his pawns. Um, yeah, maybe we can go further. Yeah, he, well, he put his pawns on f3 and e4, and, and I was getting killed. Uh, so, so I thought maybe even when you play quite... Um, well, as far as I knew, there is a game here of Aronian Kramnik, if I'm not mistaken. But of course, well, you, you get so many lines in your mind that you're never like 100% sure, mm -hmm. but I was pretty sure this position was reached in Aronian Kramnik. And the game went bishop b5. Yeah, and, uh, and here I spent half an hour thinking about my move, and I regretted not playing bishop b5. And something like this. If I'm not mistaken, this was the game, Arun and Kramnik. So somehow I saw he's so excited about his position, and I didn't really, <laughs> I didn't really understand why, because I thought, well, I've checked it uh, with a computer, I've, son I've seen the games, and somehow i don't know i'm not really inventing anything so special here but uh, on the other hand he he played this move which i haven't checked i haven't seen before and uh, it actually looks it, like a decent move to to play on mm -hmm. and to to see what black is also doing and oh rook a c8 i should probably have to play and rook fc1 and here there are a few moves and the, the danger also in this position is that with black you don't you don't feel such an immediate danger mm -hmm. but if you do something wrong then sometimes can really you, you can get into a very passive position so i wasn't really sure maybe queen a3 was another idea here or just h6 what i played looks pretty safe so basically what white is trying to do is say that this bishop on b7 uh, is uh is knocking into the this fantastic pawn formation for white so as long as that bishop remains out of play i really thought i had uh quite a good uh position um yeah bishop e2 yeah we were discussing maybe this could be the moment to to take on on c8 yeah take on c8 take 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 queen c1 B because now he he cannot play bishop d7 even even now i could play it actually <laughs> Even now, queen c7, queen b4 is good enough. I, I've seen this in the game as well. So actually, d4 is very weak. And yeah, that is true. So actually, I mean, not really. I, I didn't feel such a, such a danger. Maybe I played way too slow for, for the position. But on the other hand, it was almost my first time playing this. So, well, I didn't really. I mean, I, I just was in a training uh, with the training, yes. But it's not the same like playing it in a real game. Yeah. So basically, no. That was, that is the uh, issue. The d4 pawn is always the, yeah, the problem yeah, of course. for white. So and and all, all, it's when the queen goes to b4, there is million just checks. Yeah, checks. Uh, an e1, e3, d4, whatever. So even bishop d7 here was still possible. But anyway, bishop b7, I don't think it's such a. Yeah. It might be in the long term. Yeah, no, because this bit. is starting to be very reminiscent of the blitz games I had with Magnus, <laughs> uh, and and there he kind of just. He exchanged off all the rooks, and then he kind of just held a grip, and then gradually advanced his pawns uh, on the king's side. Uh, so I was basically trying to do the same thing, but I just I, I couldn't succeed. Yeah, bishop b2, queen d6. I thought, oh, it's another move. It's it's hard to tell whether it's which move is the best. A3. Well, he doesn't want you don't want to take immediately, but. Well, of course, I mean it's a useful move, but on the other hand, it's also under attack. So it's, I mean, yeah. I don't think it improves your position like crazy, but maybe a little bit. Basically. No, well, basically, if I could get two moves in a row in which a three is one of them, mm -hmm. I, I thought you, if, you if want it's to take what's yeah, if it's my move now, um, how is it? If it's my move now, well, 
then, you want then to take I one. wanted to go rook takes c Well, yeah, I mean, I could just take and now play rook c this, this will give you this yeah. extra tempo, yeah? Take, take queen c3 and bishop somewhere. Yeah. Well, I thought just to come here, for example. And really? now what, queen before or what? Well, now I will go g3, uh, king g2. g3, let's say knight d7. Uh, sorry, so I should go uh, bishop b5 first. Bishop b5. Okay, let's say I go a6. And then bishop a4, I guess. Bishop a4. Maybe five, let's say. Should be no b three. You can't. We should see two, maybe. Knight d seven. I mean, it's hard to believe that I have big problems here. Actually, I don't know. It looks so safe, and uh, well, it's a playable position, but yeah, I don't really think it's something. Very, well, very this efficient. is basically what I thought was the maximum. <laughs> so <laughs> if if this is nothing, then probably it's a very good opening for black. Uh, yeah. But I, I would, I would, I, I mean, would, this I would is, like this, to play this. I position. mean, I actually started became a little bit optimistic here. That's why I played knight d7 because yeah, I, yeah. I thought this was should be enough to to hold. But knight d7, I thought, okay, this becomes a little bit more tricky. And if you want to play for a win, then yeah, no, then, no, I think I mean, knight, knight, d4 d4 is, knight d7, I think is a good move. Knight c4, I thought is the only idea. Yeah, no, I, I was upset with c7. myself for this a3, because well, you precisely could, because it allows yeah. this knight d7. Uh -huh, but I thought you would play maybe here something like queen d2 or something, I don't know. I mean, you, you blitzed out bishop d3, which was like the most interesting moment of the game for me, and you just played it immediately. And on the most boring positions, you are thinking like crazy, so I was like surprised. But uh, on the other hand, I mean, we were already with... Yeah, and you need to make a move. Uh, no, I, I really felt it. like I needed to speed up because yeah, yeah, earlier yeah. I thought my position is very good. Yeah. Uh, and so, and so now I, you don't feel that anymore. So, so I was trying to, you know, find the correct moves, play objectively good chess, and now it's just like I messed <laughs> this up. Now I just gotta m make sure I don't lose lose the game. Yeah. Well, yeah. No, this looks. B5, this B5, looks queen nice. B6, queen before. But there is even this move actually, and bec it becomes very tricky. This position actually, it becomes very tricky actually. This because d4 is also under attack, and well, you can also get in trouble here. Yeah. So uh, I mean, I saw this trick actually. I was very happy about because here and then I have this rook d1. Because <laughs> because actually, otherwise it might be unpleasant because you yeah. change queens and then. But this this move is just winning. So actually, and here I wasn't sure how to play for you because if you come back. There is also this move, knight c6, and uh, I think it might just be a draw. If this move you take here, and then I probably have to take on e2 and just propose the draw. Uh, maybe, uh, this move I missed, actually, in the yeah. game. No, but you have checked. Yeah, bishop a6 or something. It should, should be enough to, to make a draw. Yeah. yeah. Well, queen d2, I thought it's Yeah, actually, I was move. expecting qu queen c6. Uh, uh -huh. So I guess we were both surprised. Uh, I was I didn't even dream about that. <laughs> so maybe well, with queen c6, then you can go to a4. To a4. Okay, yeah. yeah. No, I was happy with queen c7 because you are pinned with the rook on c2, yeah, which is sure. also tricky. So okay, bishop d3, b5, knight d2, and well, I was pretty optimistic till I actually. Then I, I don't know why I was thinking about this move, not not about king f2 immediately. I'm not sure why. Uh, but here, what if I go here? But e even a move like this, you can make it I, if I, you want. Well, I, I thought I'd uh, even slightly like better. Oh, okay. Well, no, After d5. Could be. Yeah, could be. I mean, mm, well, not really sure, but yeah. I mean, yeah. King f2. Well, I don't know why I was thinking like crazy about this line. Here, king f2. Now that I take queen d4. And this is what I saw previously so i was happy about my position but now i saw this here take and then i win the piece but actually the knight is trapped well trapped not pinned actually so actually maybe even white is better or something I don't know. rook a8 or but i'm trying to make a draw already here probably i'm, I'm not better at all i thought this was even enough but maybe queen of two is easier yeah actually i think you are better after rook a8 yeah yeah because no. you get b4 and bishop a6. I think actually yeah, I saw yeah, something could, could similar. Be, yeah, yeah may, but maybe this is just way simpler. Yeah? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, well, well, it's a pity that I spent like one hour thinking about something. And then when the real position comes, you, you offer me a draw and I'm like, <laughs> well, I mean, if, if I would have 
more time than, than probably it's a position you, you can actually think about because it's, it's yeah. quite interesting here already I mean it, it's it got quite I don't know here. maybe why it's better I, I just uh, yeah, I well. seriously dislike that the grip uh, I thought I was gonna have with this plan not playing Magnus without risk anymore, me. Yeah. yeah no now it's more of a black has some good squares some good pieces mm -hmm. and especially the pressure against the d4 pawn um, on the other hand if you manage to play something like knight b3 yeah, no, you, that, you, there's you definitely very potential. Solid, uh, knight c5 or something yeah, at some yeah. point. Bishop only 2 But uh, it's true that right now with bishop on d3 is a little bit strange. And uh, yeah. No, I mean, it's, it's in a clear position. I mean, well, so uh, actually, I was even expecting queen a5. Yeah, this, this was the other move I thought about. And I wasn't really sure what to do here after king f2. Because b5 is also hanging. And. Well, I wasn't really sure why why to reject the draw for here because I mean I got some activity, but on the other hand, c7 is always weak, so it's, yeah. it's not easy how to get rid of that. I mean, I thought king f2, let's say here, and then bishop b2 or something. And this kind of position, well, I'm not sure what. Maybe this is what I was trying to achieve. As long as the bishop is still on b7, yeah, exactly. the then you have here. this problem with the. But I don't know. Move like this, it's quite interesting actually knight, knight b8 knight c6 sometimes and, yeah uh, i mean i think Black yeah because this pawn structure with with yeah. e4 and, and and f3 is especially good when you have the knight on f6 yeah of course, of course. Uh, because then it's both taking out the bishop and the knight whereas now the knight is coming in attacking d4 and yeah I mean, here starts the game actually i don't know yeah. maybe there is well i mean a little bit double-edged. I, I don't know what's going on. I mean, right now I like black in, in this particular moment, but a minute ago I didn't like it so much, so <laughs> I'm not so sure. Yeah, I mean, and also we are just making moves, which I'm not sure are the... No, this move I, I saw, and but my first intention was to play queen b6. So if I start to recalculate and try it now, queen a5, it will yeah, take then some use, time, and yeah, then you know, like 10, 15 time. minutes, and... Well, I'm not that desperate to, to take a risk or to... I mean, yeah. the, the tournament is long and so... Well. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah.